Welcome back to Skywalker Weekly on Flailing Friday featuring Cinnamon. He's actually in the room, but he's just not in the view, you know, of the camera. Mwah ha ha ha, I have captured him. And of course, you might remember from last week, I've got my little friend Fairy Floss here as well. Yeah! So as the title suggests, today is going to be all about showing off some skirts that I like. And actually, I've picked my top five skirts. And, I mean, they might not actually be my top favourite skirts. They were just five skirts that today I saw and I thought, I like all these skirts and which one am I going to wear today? So I'm going to show you guys each one. But before we get into that, let's just have some gossip. You know, Skywalker, what's the word on the street? So... My friend, as you know from Instagram, she just had a baby and I went to visit an OMG, so cute. This baby, it is, it is so cute. And I mean, you know whenever you go to visit people's babies, no matter what they look like, they could look like a creepy alien, you still say, oh, that's the cutest baby ever, alien baby. Oh, your baby is so cute. Yeah, I mean, all babies, they do start off looking a bit weird, but they get cute eventually. I was a pretty weird looking baby. But this time, I kid you not, it is like the cutest baby ever. I want one. I want two. I want ten. But her baby, it's got this strange kind of quirk. So when I pick up a baby, I usually hold it kind of like this. You know, that's how we're all taught. This is how you hold a baby. This is how you rock a baby. That kind of thing. And also, how cute is my baby? <laughs> but her baby, if you hold it like that, it's just, wah, wah. it doesn't like it. And so I'm like, oh, okay, what do I do? So I try to hold it, you know, like this, you know, little baby, and it's just like, rah, rah. and what I realised, and my friend showed me, her baby, you have to hold it with your hand on its butt, and then it's just like, ah. do you guys like my little baby? <laughs> little baby cinnamon. He's my only baby for now, but I want to have a human cinnamon this year. Maybe. He's very placid today. You know, Cinnamon has those days where he's just, oh, I'm Cinnamon, I'm just gonna sleep. Hmm, okay, now he's a wriggly worm. I'll let him wriggle away. I think he's barking at some noise. There's something going on. Can you hear him? I think he stopped. All right, people, let's get on to the top five skirts of the day. Cause I got a lot more than five skirts. But today it's just five of them. And I couldn't not start without this one. And yeah, it's pink, it's fluffy, it feels like cinnamon. In fact, don't tell cinnamon, but I think it's actually softer than him. Just just a little bit. But yeah, so this skirt, I mean, who else likes this skirt? It feels like the fluff on fairy floss. Yeah. <laughs> so this is a very Skywalker skirt. I don't think many people would wear this skirt. I have worn it quite a bit. It's super stretchy, super soft. You know, you can't go wrong with a pink fluffy skirt. But hey, where are you going to find it? I actually bought this as a dress off YesStyle and then I cut it into a skirt because it was a full long sleeve dress and it was too hot and I was like, oh, sweating and I thought, oh, I'm just not going to be able to wear this. Oh, oh, cinnamon's just come over. Here he is. 
I love you. <laughs> yeah, so this one I actually cut into a skirt and I just love it because it's soft. It's like cinnamon, ah, oh, skirt, yeah. So that's number one. And I bet you're all thinking, geez, Sky, do you ever not wear pink? Well, let me tell you, my second skirt of the day is actually blue, the polar opposite of pink. So, this one I've also featured on Instagram. It's a great skirt. I'll show you guys. It's a Beckenbridge kind of design there with the flowers, and it's blue. It's not pink, but it still is really cute. It's actually one of my favorite skirts. It's another summer skirt, you know, summer design kind of thing. All right, so that was number two. What's gonna be number three? And talking about Beckham Bridge, my third favorite skirt of the day is another Beckham Bridge skirt. It is a floral patterny skirt. And you've really got to see this close up to appreciate it. See all its glory. Yes, this one you might recognize from Instagram. I have a picture where I've got a toy. Actually, I'll just find it because it's here. This guy, don't you love him? I got a picture where I got him sitting on the skirt. Yeah, so this is the skirt that he was sitting on. Isn't he a cutie? And you can see a little cinnamon in the background. He's just, you know, guarding my studio. Like a good boy he is. <laughs> Alright, so that's skirt three. So we're up to skirt four. Alright, so the fourth skirt of today is fire red. And I really like red because it's pretty similar to pink, but it's brighter. And this one, it is just the hot red skirt. In fact, it's a little bit too short, so usually when I wear this, I will put some tights on underneath, you know, some black tights to get that real red black, I'm red back spider kind of look, that sort of thing. But today I'm just showing you the skirt as it is. So yeah, it's a cute one. Yeah. Alright, so you've seen one, you've seen two, you've seen three, you've seen four. What is skirt number five? Skirt number five is stripey. And I don't know what it is, but I really like stripes. I really like spots as well. I'll show you my spotty skirt another time. But stripes for some reason, they're just cool. And a lot of people will say you need to have stripes going downwards because, you know, it makes you look slimmer or whatever. But I think any stripes are good stripes. Of course, I mean, if it was pink stripes, it would be a bit better. But, you know, these are the only stripes I have. So out of these five skirts, which do you think is the best? Because, I mean, I know what Fairy Force thinks. She thinks this one's the best because it looks like her. But I don't know, let me know in the comments or whatever which skirt you think is the best. Whether you think it's pink and fluffy, or fire red, or stripy, or flowers, or blue, or if you think, geez, show me some of your other skirts, I don't like any of these skirts. So yeah, let me know what you guys think is cute. So, I mean, I'm not going to end the show without featuring a bit more of my baby, because I all know that you pretty much just watched this to see Cinnamon. So let's find him. Simon sweetie! Come here. Good boy! Hello! He's just wanted. Now one thing you gotta know about Cinnamon is he is obsessed with those little treats called Schmackles! 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 Have you seen the ads where they say Dogs go whack for Schmackles! Well, you might see that and think, oh yeah, that's just another ad. But it is true. Schmackos are like addictive drugs for dogs. And cinnamon, he he to schmackos is like me to sugar. He loves them. He's just like, oh, give me schmackos. So I thought I better demonstrate this to you guys because usually when I give him treats I give him a different kind of treat which he loves but it's no schmacko. So watch this.
And we have Cinnamon here, who really, really wants it. There you go. And he runs off with it. See, I wanted you to see him eat it. Because when he eats it, he actually holds it in his hands like this. And then he eats it kind of like you need a banana, you know, like, um, um, um. and it's just so cute. But you know what my boy is like. When he gets his treat, phew, he's gone. Let's find him. All right, well, he's not holding it the proper way that he usually does, but he really does usually do it. So just believe me, and I, I promise one time I'm going to catch him. I'm going to catch you, Cinnamon, eating it the cute way. So thanks so much, guys, for watching Skywalk Away Clear again on this beautiful Flailing Friday, and I will catch you guys next Flailing Friday, which is next week. And in the meantime, please catch us on Instagram, Skywalker Happy, I guess you know that. And have an excellent week. Just have fun and I hope you all do something silly this week and don't get too stressed with exams or work or school or whatever yucky things there are in your life that are stressing you out. So a big goodbye from Sky and a little goodbye from little Cinnamon there. He's just in the background playing with all the toys. What a life. I'll see you guys next week.